Thanks for tuning in to my YouTube channel, Mr. Ham Guts and Glory. I'm Mr. Ham Guts and Glory, and in this video, I will show you my idea for a cheap pump pool cover. I'm using the galvanized steel poles that cyclone fencing or chain link fencing uh, is attached and corrugated aluminum metal for the cover and one by two treated lumber self drilling screws that the one by two treated lumber will attach to the uh, vertical poles and metal screws that the aluminum corrugated metal will attach to the wood I'm using one and five eighth inch for the four corners and one and three eighths inch for the arches the one and three eighths inch slips into the one and five eighths inch nicely and then screwed using self drilling screws to secure it the four corner poles are driven into the ground using a t-post driver and i drew um, hammered them down about a foot and then built the frame for the cement pad to reinforce the poles the length of pipe needed for the arches was calculated using two pi r divided by two uh, and then i added one foot that one foot uh, the additional foot was divided in half uh, to give me additional six inches on each side so that it could slide into the four uh, into the two corner poles that I would be able to then uh, use the self drilling screws to um, secure the arch to the corner poles so I used a tree to uh, form the arch uh, using the one and three eighths inch pipe as you can see I began forming the arches using a tree after slightly making my first bend each crease was then a guide as to how far to line up for the next bend you know uh, after forming uh, the arch I then measured the distance between the two ends so that I could insert them into the corner poles and if I needed to you know adjust the arches a little bit after uh, getting my measurement then I'm, I put it back into the tree there and, and just kept forming it until I had the length that I needed after inserting the arches into the corner poles I left a, enough of the vertical part of each end uh, to attach the one by twos and once I had attached the one by twos I then used a level and slid uh, the arches up or down at each corner uh, to help me level once leveled I used self drilling screws to secure the arches to the corner poles now then attached the rest of the one by twos along around the arches at the location where the corrugated metal pieces overlapped I hope this video helped you some or gave you a few ideas uh, the rest of the video is just showing the final look of it don't forget to hit the subscribe button you can find me on google searching mr ham guts and glory thanks for tuning in to my youtube channel mr ham guts and glory if you like my video hit the like button use the comment section below and let me know if i'm on the right track or not thanks for watching